How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. And today we're going to be teaching how to change different oils into other oils and adjust fluid recipes with mixing and a couple of other things. This has been based off a comment from Camer5371, if I'm pronouncing your name right. If not, I am very sorry. Their comment was, I'm trying to use this to convert from one type of oil and create diesel generator to the create the factory must grow one because the oil wells in this world aren't spawning. But even though it says no more errors, it's not doing anything at all. And looking at some of the other responses and comments they had, they showed their recipe too. And most of it looked proper. But I did just do a video on the create sifting. And I explained something in the very beginning of that video that explains this exact comment actually. And it was all spe spelling errors. Now I've broke down how to find the tags for every type of block, no matter whether it's modded or not. I've explained how to look those up. But for this one specifically, we're going to walk through it one more time or again this time i know we're probably going to do other times which is completely a-okay so to help explain what you're looking for when it comes to the tags go ahead and hold f3 and hit h to show your tooltips it'll give you more information on the naming of how things work and they said in their code that they did or they actually posted their code so i could read it and they typed in fluid and then tfmg for the factory must grow where their errors were was the naming well the naming convention so they see at the very bottom it shows create and then the factory must grow or the tfmg and those aren't the namings so what you want to look for is in the gray letters which is the naming of each mod so this one is create industry and then coal coke block create industry steel door create industry steel vertical gearbox so in this case they should have used create industry crude oil and then the create diesel generators crude oil we're going to show you guys what we have here of course we got the buckets here and we have a mixture so this one right here should be doing one of the crude oils and this one right here should be doing water this is the recipe we're setting up we're pumping both water and crude oil of type diesel so this one right here we're doing the create diesel generator or the create diesel crude oil is being pumped into the basin that's the one they wanted to use to make the other one then we got water pumping into it makes no sense i know but it's all in the basin and then when we mix it it'll all get pumped out now it's not doing anything because this is completely full of 1.8 thousand buckets but if we go ahead and get a bucket an empty bucket we have everything pumping out into this basin so we can always grab one and it should actually start mixing because we have a bucket go ahead and do that and you can see it'll just keep mixing until this bad boy gets full again and there we go now if we go ahead and actually go to survival and get the bucket you can see that we have crude oil bucket from create industry or also better known as the factory must grow it's actually fairly simple the code was pretty much spot on with what they did but let's go ahead and show you how we do it once again we've already shown this before let's go ahead and get rid of some of the server scripts this is the actual server script where everything is at but i will show how to do it all back from scratch so when you're on your mod pack of choice that you're trying to change things for as long as you have create or cube.js installed and you've ran it at least once click the three little dots and click open folder then you want to go ahead and find your cube.js folder if you guys have already followed some of my tutorials you guys have already seen these and you should probably already have it then you want to go to server scripts and then i have a bunch of them here because i actually just found out recently that you can duplicate and then make a bunch of scripts as long as the beginning starts with recipe and it's a javascript file it actually reads all of them and this right here is the create or the recipe oil mixing go ahead and open with visual studio and this is all it is now it's really not that hard of course you got your fluids your fluids and your fluids because it's easy we're using a fluid and another fluid to create another fluid so this is what i was talking about with the naming convention now i'm not really trying i'm not putting nobody down about naming conventions that's the whole reason why these tutorials are here to help some people but you can see it's called create industry crude oil not the factory must grow crude oil and you can't um even if it was the factory must grow you still couldn't i don't even know what the word is called where you shorten the words down like lol means laughing out loud you can't do that you have to actually spell the whole thing out it doesn't like whenever you condense the word down to being like the beginning letters of everything so create industry semicolon crude underscore oil and it's going to give you at least one full bucket of course we're using fluid minecraft water of amount of a half a bucket and then fluid create diesel generators crude oil at a half a bucket and of course it is mixing it with the create mixing and it is making the crude oil from create industry or the factory must grow it was a very simple one 
But that right there shows that right there shows you how simple mistakes can fly right under the radar, especially when it's not known by everybody. And it's okay because I've done it too. On my last video I just did, I spent 20 minutes recording a video and I had so many spelling errors halfway throughout the video that I had to re-record the whole thing. So mistakes happen, but that is how you fix all of that. And if this was helpful for you guys and you guys want to see more things like this, please let me know what you guys want to see and I'll do my best to get to them as soon as possible. So thank you guys for watching this video. Let me know more down below what you guys want to see and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.